What's going on guys, it's Harley, it's Untold. I hope the vibes are immaculate today, and I hope you guys enjoy the reaction. We're going to be reacting to the next three episodes of Dragon Ball. Of course, if you enjoy the content, consider subscribing. We're only at about 50 subs right now, and we're working our way up, so if you guys enjoy, go ahead and consider subscribing. But hey, no worries. But if you liked the video, leave a like. I apologize if I pronounce Yamcha's name wrong at all during this video or last video. The subtitles state Yamucha-sama, so I was actually pronouncing it in the Japanese version, which is probably wrong to a lot of casual viewers and and longtime viewers of the show. So I just want to apologize for that. And from now on, I'll be pronouncing it as Yamsha. If I'm still butchering it, let me know. Oh shit, I just realized the uh, the episode name is the Kamihamiha Wave. Are we gonna learn what that means today? I don't know, but I'm excited now. Uh, I think we actually learned about the Nimbus Cloud of Roshi before we met Roshi or knew that his name was Roshi, sorry, rather. So I could see them like doing this again, naming the episode Kamihamiha Wave, but we like see something don't know what it is yet i'm not sure but i'm excited to get into it so without further ado all right here we go let's do it yo i just realized we have six of the dragon balls or we're about to at least and we already know where the seventh's at i was wondering where the seventh was at but uh pilaf has it i think right i'm excited to like kind of like learn more about the turtle hermit now now that we know that uh he trained uh gohan i think his name was which is uh goku's grandfather so that's uh, really interesting, actually. Oh, that's a, that's a really cool uh, intro screen. It's probably my favorite so far. It just, the, the color scheme matches so well. Wait, what? Okay, I actually have to go back and... Wait, what? Given to me by Kami-sama himself? And then it said, like, God. Did it just... Wait. Was it saying he... What? Did he get it from a God? <laughs> I'll make sure. <laughs> Lamau. Be funny if he wasn't Roshi. Oh, what the hell? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. It's in his head. <laughs> I thought he dodged it. <laughs> what? I love how blades have, like, no effect on anybody. Like, that actually like, went into him, but didn't kill him, obviously. We've seen Goku and, I think, Oolong both get... Or, no, it was, uh... It was Yamucha's, uh... Sorry for pronouncing that wrong, but it's... It was his, uh, little companion that both got hit with blades and nothing happened. <laughs> Why is this the plot point? Turtle's a real one. Turtle Hermit. Oh, really? He has eternal life? What the hell? I love the turtle's comments about Roshi. Oh, shit? Baby Gamera? What in the hell? Is this like the evil version? <laughs> the corrupt version? Is he, like, praising him? I like the fire as well behind her. <laughs> what in the hell? <laughs> Jesus Christ. What was done to his back? Reminds me of, like, Rocket from Guardians, almost. Is he just getting swarves? Oh my god, he really is. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> my man went from Rocket to Hulk. <laughs> what? Yeah, Kamihamiha, the Kami house. That that makes sense. Hey yo. Is this our first like hint of like what's to come? What the hell? <laughs> I 
Now she's back to normal, okay? <laughs> Did he destroy it? Oh my god. Dude, what the hell? Why does, like, why is he so overpowered? Oh shit. Does it really take 50 years? Or is he just saying that because it took him 50 years? <laughs> I don't think Goku's told him that he, uh, he's Gohan's grandkid, right? Oh shit. Why is he trying to get on the car? <laughs> oh my god, is he doing it? What the fuck? <laughs> Why would he try it on the car? Oh, now he knows. A tail and took him in. Then why does he call him Grandpa? Interesting. These guys are so unnecessarily assholish. <laughs> that is a new word, assholish. Hey, the six stars? Oh no, seven. So Pilaf has the six star, I think. I don't think we've gotten the six yet. This guy's really nice considering like what Roshi just did to his castle. But he also like praises the dude, so it makes sense, I suppose. It's crazy Goku could barely touch the the demon emperor or whatever. But he like Roshi seems or he seems like actually scared of Roshi. Oh my god, yes. Bulma, you're so smart. You're so smart. You counter the pervertedness. Do not accept it. <laughs> Shut up, Oolong. Shut up and do it. Just do it. <laughs> so if he can turn into her like that, how he turned into her last episode in this episode was just how he saw her. <laughs> Oh my god, Goku. <laughs> you don't know what you're agreeing to, my guy. <laughs> it's like, I don't know what a wedding is, but sure, marriage. If that's what you want, I got you. <laughs> I'm also interested to see the dragon. I've seen him in the intro, but... I want to see Moa. Alright, I think that's the end of the episode. We had the narrator talk us out, and now we're about to see Bulma sitting there like... <laughs> but yeah, that was a pretty good episode. Uh, I I enjoyed a lot of the aspects of it. Um, I'm interested to see like what the hell happens with this whole Kamehameha shit. Like, bruh, like he was sitting there like talking it up. Like, 50 years of training, you you gotta like try for 50 years. You will never learn this, so don't even bother, kid. And then he's like, huh? <laughs> Done. <laughs> um. I'm glad that Roshi knows that Goku is Gohan's grandkid, at least, uh, now, because that aspect of the show really intrigued me. I really want to know what's going on with that. And, yeah, I don't know. Uh, let's move on to the next episode, though. I'm excited to get into more of this. It's getting pretty interesting. So without further ado, here we go. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I felt a little low on energy, despite drinking an energy drink, and uh, it just hit me. It's because I forgot to eat breakfast. Big brain. <laughs> know what I'm doing after the video now. We're just in Mushroomville. Ooh, I wonder if we're getting close to uh, Pilaf. It's crazy to me that Oolong is still like a kind of like ally to us. They're getting along great. He's trailing behind so close. <laughs> Way to be obvious. <laughs> if these had rear view mirrors, you would be screwed, just so you know. <laughs> I 
Yes, I also have white foam coming out of my mouth when I see a woman. Tis how the twerks. <laughs> all this, oh my god, this episode has something to do with a rabbit. They think that she is whatever that is. What did a bunny rabbit do to this poor town? <laughs> that scared, what the hell? This is kind of cool to see a store for the capsules. <laughs> She's just getting everything for free out of pure terror. It's fantastic. Oh, what the hell? Bunny ears and a gun. I can see how they got it mixed up with Bama. <laughs> Rabbit gang. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay. Guns don't work on Goku. Oh, you let him finish eating. That was your first mistake. <laughs> I love when the theme plays. <laughs> I got a bad feeling about this. Star Wars, sorry. Turn you into a carrot and eat you. What? <laughs> What's Oolong worried about? He could just turn himself back into something else. <laughs> like, turn himself into something metal as he bites. Big brain. <laughs> he literally has a rabbit mobile. I'm not too sure I could take this guy seriously. It's a cute little car for your little gang. <laughs> Oh my god, he's- okay, he's literally a rabbit. What the fuck? Okay. I- I could take that a little more seriously, because it makes sense, kinda. I don't know, I've never seen a human put a human face on a car, but you know. <laughs> he probably knows some, like, Kamehameha shit. Dude, Yamucha's like- or, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but like, he is always just creeping around the corner. <laughs> The rabbit carrot transformer. <laughs> so he wasn't just saying that. Like, that's just his ability. Imagine this is how Balma dies. Just immediately being eaten. Kind of an OP power, though, honestly. Like, you can't touch him. <laughs> oh, yeah, big brain. I forgot about the... Noyobu? I don't know how to pronounce that, either. I'm so bad at these. So bad. I'm, I'm a dumb American. I don't know shit. <laughs> Poor Goku. Oh, is he gonna help? Oh, Pog? I'm telling you, I can see him as a damn ally. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because he looks like <laughs> Goku like when he's older. I don't know. But like, I feel like he's an ally. I said that in like the first episode he was introduced in. I get ally vibes, but then he's like, give me your money and your capsules. Fuck you. <laughs> like, I don't know. And Oolong is like a perverted asshole that we're hanging out with. It's it's it's, it's confusing structure. <laughs> oh. Let's go. Just following you casually. Oh my god. Stick him. You've done a midair stick before. Do it again. He's a little worried now. No. Uh -oh. That's what I'm saying, though. Can he just transform back, though? Like, I wonder how that works. <laughs> Wait, will that work? Can he copy power? Yo, that's interesting if he can. 
At the very least, he believes that he can. It's funny if it was the wrong one. I don't lie. I don't think he has yet, so I'll see if he holds true to that. I think he's too ignorant to be manipulative. Oh god. <laughs> Yamucha and uh, Balma make more sense than uh, most of the uh, impending relationships, I guess, in the show. <laughs> that being said, though, I don't know how old... Uh... I hate saying it because I feel like I'm saying it wrong, but Yamucha, I feel like that's butchering it. Oh, I think I've seen at least like part of this and I... And like the intro, because it reminds me of, like Mario, like when you jump on the flag at the end. Yeah, where'd he take them? Oh my god. <laughs> Can they breathe? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> They're making peeps. That's that's their sentence. <laughs> that was fantastic actually. I really enjoyed that episode. Um uh, it didn't have a lot of aspects I didn't like at all. Like, I actually quite enjoyed that episode through and through. Um, it, it was cool to see, like, it started, it, it's cool to start to see, like, uh, other people with, like, power. Because, like, we know, obviously, like, I, I'm not ignorant to culture. I've seen, like, Goku, like, lighting up in fire some way, shape, or form in the future. I know that's eventually way down the line a thing. But it's cool to see, like... It's not just him. Like they got some whack ass powers, and like animals talk, and like they're considered people. And this universe has a lot of interesting aspects to it that I'm really interested to dig more into. <laughs> so without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the last episode of today, which is the the Dragon Balls are stolen. So I can guess the plot of this episode. If if I had to take a wild guess, I would say the Dragon Balls are probably stolen. That is my guess. But let's go ahead and get into it, guys. That's actually crazy, bro. The center is so long. I just went to the bathroom, came back. Still going. <laughs> it's got my back. <laughs> I wonder who steals them. I could see uh, Yamucha doing it or Pilaf. Or like Pilaf's some uh, minions. Or even Oolong. I forgot about him for some reason. <laughs> kind of putting it into perspective though <laughs> Balma you're 16 chill that mole that was like digging though also could be oh no never mind I was gonna say that could also be the one that takes it but the uh, peel off's like castle or fortress is literally what we're shown <laughs> for the intro so I doubt it is that like a robotic bird or did he like cybernetically enhance a bird <laughs> I love how he says the two missing I'm really really curious as to like if it's one wish, or if like multiple people can do it. <laughs> is his name Shu? I've seen that reappear a few times, so I think his name is Shu. I don't know what her name is, though. <laughs> is he? Oh my god. <laughs> He's literally taking pa <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, apparently we have the uh, six-star ball, because he has the one-star. I wonder if he's emperor of, like, this entire, like, desolate planet. Or just, like, the fucking universe. Like, is he Palpatine? Like, little... <laughs> what is he emperor of? <laughs> they really are kind of handing, like, six balls to them, like, when they only found one. <laughs> If it's only one wish, it's like pretty self-centered of Bulma to use it for that, and like that's it, like, and, th and then they're like done for, you know, like. Yeah, he seems to care like what happens to them, but he's just creeping in the background trying to be bad. It's weird. <laughs> oh god, that's a missile. <laughs> they're fine. <laughs> Pilaf seems to have, like, a lot of tech. Like, specifically tech. Even gave him something to carry it in. <laughs> I wonder if Pilaf will make the wish. 
And I'm really curious if they just burn out after that, because, like, there's only seven, and they don't know he has the last one. They can kind of assume, based on the direction they're going, and them having the radar, but they don't have confirmation, I don't think. As a matter of fact, they haven't even met Diloth himself. Oh, shit. Yeah. Every scene of Pilaf bullying somebody has been his own people. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Goku, Goku, Goku. Dodged. <laughs> I think Caveman Goku is my favorite side of Goku. <laughs> <laughs> what a weakling. <laughs> oh, God. She is, like, overly distressed about having a boyfriend. It's okay. <laughs> I didn't even notice. I didn't count them. <laughs> it does make sense, though, because she's, like, 16. So, like, having a boyfriend is, like, the equivalent of, like getting a new car or something, like, it's really cool at that age, I guess. I don't know. Wasting a magical wish on it, though, like... Yikes. <laughs> Looks like you have to help again. Yep. <laughs> I don't know why, but I want this guy to be good. I, I don't have a real reasoning here other than I want him to be good. Watch the road, my guy. <laughs> Look at the road. <laughs> Why? He's driving. Why do you want him to close his eyes? Bulma, seek help. Yeah, literally, because you're going to be closing your eyes while driving. Oh, my goodness. Okay, uh, that's actually smart. Bulma's big brain. He has the tooth missing, too. <laughs> Why does that look like Earth? <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> Goku's too big brain for you. I don't know, Pilaf. With Yamucha and Goku, I'm not sure you stand a chance, I'll be honest. But then again, can Goku, like, break out of, like, his metal arms that he can, like, control and stuff? So, I don't know. Heal off. Pay the electric bill, bro. <laughs> I just threw her down. <laughs> He didn't freeze that time, Pog. Oh shit, he just did like the same like hand motion as like the uh, Kamehameha. <laughs> Lol. Is this for Pilaf to get around or is this a trap? It's like Jaws. Donna, 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 Donna. And trapped. Oh, we leave it off on a cliffhanger? Oh shit. That's exciting. So it just confirmed, the narrator confirmed next episode that all seven will be together. So we will get to see what happens with that. I'm actually really excited to, uh, get more into this holy crap yeah i can't wait guys um but yeah that was a really fucking great episode like the last two episodes have been probably like some, some of my favorites like if not my favorites so far um the 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 outdated humor actually seems to be slowly dialing itself down i don't know if that's uh gonna happen this early but so far like last two episodes actually they, they were good and really low on that aspect of the show and 
I thoroughly enjoyed them, and I'm I'm really interested to see where it goes with like the uh, the seven Dragon Balls and Pilaf officially meeting Goku and freaking Goku pow like Goku's powers like bruh. There's so much I'm excited for in this show, and we got a long way to go. And I I'm I'm a huge fan of continuity. I love Doctor Who. I love the Marvel Universe. I love stretched out complex continuity, and there's not a lot of shows where you can see the childhood before the crazy continuity. So I don't know. I, I'm excited for the future of it. And um, yeah, I hope you guys are excited for the future of the reactions. But uh, yeah, that'll about do it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Without further ado, we're going to get out of here. But I uh, hope you guys have a wonderful night and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See you later.